This will be a short video on how to replace the LCD screen in your e-machine's laptop. Uh, it uh, fell and hit the floor and cracked the screen. So the first thing is uh, power down your machine and remove the battery and the power and the uh, power plug. Next step is there are these black covers actually they're like rubber bumpers but there's actually screws behind there to get this piece off the screen. To get these little rubber bumpers off that hide the screws I just take a small little screwdriver very carefully try to work underneath it. There's some sticky stuff on the back side. very carefully peel it up and then you'll expose the screw. There are four screws holding this trim piece on. One, two, three, four. There's a bumper there and a bumper there. There actually is nothing behind there. So then we have to separate the two halves. So I take my pocket knife there's a little bit of a gap here. You just start prying apart like this and very slowly. Go all the way around and you'll hear it snap as it comes apart. Okay, as you can see, just go very carefully around the edges until you get this worked free. It's still hanging on the bottom. So just very carefully apply pressure. Try not to break any of these tabs, and eventually you will get this piece to snap off in one piece, hopefully. You can see up towards the top there is a spot for a webcam. I don't have the webcam. That's what that extra connector is for. Okay, the next step is there are some screws along the side of the screen, which is actually the support you have to remove those screws, there will be three on each side and this screw right here is actually part of the uh, support as well. You may have to loosen that a little bit to get access to that screw. Okay, once we have all these screws out and we can very carefully lift this up and you'll see on the back side there is the main connector we'll have to disconnect that runs underneath you can see where it goes through the hinge and plugs into the circuit board but that's not the only one we also have a connector over here which needs to be disconnected as well and then we should be able to separate the LCD screen Okay, we got the LCD screen free. Um, there's this small red and white wire connector right there. That has to be disconnected from this board right here. And it has to be routed in there a certain way. So in order to do that, uh, tick this screw loose and this thing will pop up. And then you'll be able to see how it's, there's a little loop under there. Disconnect it from the end of the circuit board here and here is the uh, the main connector that is attached to the LCD screen on the back side uh, here is an extra one this is for the webcam which mine doesn't have but you'll have to peel all this back very carefully and this is what the back of the LCD screen looks like that's right where the uh, where the main cable plugs in right there and the best thing to do if you're going to order one of these is uh, take the numbers off of your original one and match it up exactly so you get the right LCD screen size and the right connector configuration. This particular one is a Samsung unit. So I will probably search on eBay or uh, any other online vendor and usually you can buy these for $100 or less. There we go, got it fixed again for uh, a little under $100 with the shipping. Bought it from a uh, place on eBay.